Alright, alright, ladies and gents. This is gonna be my first video where I use my voice. This feels a bit like a Tinder date, you know? You just swipe right on your YouTube recommendation, and now we are on our like first date in Kimona. So, yeah, let's get this going. Today I'm gonna use the default AK-102 and give you a solo gameplay with some commentary, tips, and uh, showcase a bit of a mechanic that is probably not used enough. Drum roll, the hip fire. Tip numero uno, remove that piece. It will allow you to see better. You can do the same thing with the SKS when you do scout runs. Tip number two. These two spawn on the farm map are always guaranteed, which means there's always going to be a team that's going to spawn there. If then some on the side of the spawn, I know for sure there's going to be at least one team that's going to come from that side. I have put an interactive map in my description. It is very helpful, so you can use it to see a bit where everything is, where the spawns are, etc, etc. So it's going to be in my description, you can use it. Oh, he's coming. I can hear him. I think he's looting right now. Tip number three, always pick it up before fights. Tip number four, do not do what I just did. Standing uncovered like that is like, I got lucky. I got like really lucky. Usually when you press F to search, you have a slight window to do an action like crouch or move to cover. So you can use that time to actually slightly move yourself to some place that's a bit more covered and not expose yourself as much as I did right now. I've been thinking about making a video on how I loot and what to loot. If you think that can be useful, let me know in the comments. Tip number five. I believe in the farm map, you can have up to five teams, that is 20 players. It will be either two teams spawn on one half of the map, and three spawn on the other half. So now I can fairly assume that I am pretty safe because I did kill one guy from one team, from one spawn, and two guys from the other spawn. But you always have to be careful because there's always more. By the way, those ammo box are goaded, man. They always have good ammo in there for some reason.
usually at this distance, the spray grouping are pretty good. If you're aiming downside, two things happen. Your movement becomes slower and it takes a bit more time to ADS. Of course, depending on your ergonomics as well too. This can sometimes be the deciding factor on who wins gunfights. When you use tactical like Molotov or grenades, it should not always be used just to finish someone. Molotov can be used, for example, to tactically funnel your enemies into your line of sight and restrict movement. I mentioned this as well in my BM-59 video. If you guys should check it as well, it would be much appreciated. was another player. I'm gonna take my loot and get the fuck out. I'm not risking it. Tip number six. The end pieces scav that spawn, the reason why they are so aggressive, especially at the end, is that I believe they are programmed to focus on PMCs that are hurt, healing or heavily loaded. There's also rumors that some scav would spawn next to someone who is camping way too long. Well, 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 that was not too bad for a run. 5 PNC, some good loots. I hope you enjoyed this video. Do not forget to give a like and sub to support the channel. Keep grinding, calamity out. Peace. Um. Extra tip on actually how to hip fire properly is that um, the way I see it is that when I sit down, my back and my eye level is always the same. Um, I try to have the same position every time I play the game so that by habit I have same position, uh, same mechanic, same habits. And the way I've positioned my screen, for example, is quite high a bit like it's almost at my eye level so the center of the screen is actually at my high level eye level so every time i'm looking at the center of the screen straight forward this is pretty much where my aim is going to be at so this could be something that you can use mechanically i would say to be able to hip fire a bit better and a bit more accurate i would say <laughs>